Hi everyone. Uh, today, nearly all mainstream media wrote about massive ransomware attacks around the globe. 16 medical institutions in UK. Strong rumor that uh, huge companies in Russia and even Russian Ministry of Internal Affairs suffered damage. At this moment, Kaspersky recorded more than 45,000 attacks in 74 countries, but mostly in Russia. During this attack, ransomware WannaCry uh, encrypts data. And what I like in this WannaCry story, that is actually all about vulnerability management. WannaCry uses Eternal Blue Exploit to attack computers running the Microsoft Windows operating system. So, maybe this exploit used some unknown zero-day vulnerability? No. Patch MS-17010 for this vulnerability was published a month ago. It was marked as critical. So, maybe this vulnerability was hard to detect using vulnerability scanners. No. Here you can see Nessus local check plugin, a remote and credential check plugin. And even if you don't have a budget for Nessus Professional, here are similar vulnerability checks for free and open source open was. So maybe this vulnerability was hard to filter because of some weird CVSS vector and score. No. Access vector, network. CVSS base score, 9 and 8. It was hard to meet this vulnerability in scan results. But maybe this vulnerability were not discussed publicly. No, almost all media wrote about NSA exploits leaked by shadow brokers. It was a breaking news. And it was obvious that very soon these exploits will be actively used by ordinary criminals. It was just a matter of time. So, what can we tell about organizations that were massively affected by WannaCry? They probably have some problems with patch management process. For some reason, MS-17010 patch was not installed automatically using standard Microsoft tools. They probably have problems with vulnerability management process. For some reason, security team have not detected the fact that this critical vulnerability was not fixed for a long time and deal force patch process. It's also important if there were backups, universal solution ag against crypto lockers, and updated virus knowledge bases. Antivirus definitely not a panacea, but still better than nothing. So in conclusion, if you are curious how the results of attack look like, you can use this simple Google Doc. You will get plenty of websites hosted on vulnerable Windows machines. WannaCry was able to encrypt files inside directory, including index.html. So you can now see file structure of this site. It also creates files in for decryption. Please read me txt and wanna decryptor.exe in affected form.